We are also tracking a second deadly crash. A woman was killed on 249, the Tomball Parkway at Cypress Creek Parkway. But then as police were blocking that particular crash, an HPD officer was hit. ABC 13 reporter Courtney Fisher is there live this morning to walk us through what happened and also talk about this police officer. Do we know his condition, Courtney? Yes, Tamika, you know, we're still waiting to hear how he's doing. We know that he was taken to the hospital via ambulance and police escorted him there. Still waiting for an update. As soon as we learn how he is doing, we'll let you know, of course. I want to show you, though, still a scene behind me, that police SUV that was hit. It was just towed from scene a few minutes ago, but you can see the outbound lanes of 249 right before the tollway are still closed this morning. I want to show you video so you can see that HPD crash while well, the uh, vehicle that crashed into the HPD SUV. You see the car appears to have slammed head on into the SUV. We don't have an update yet on really what exactly happened. Did the driver just not see the HPD blo uh, cruiser wa blocking uh, traffic here? We aren't really sure why this happened. We, as soon as we get an update, of course, I will let you know again. I want to show you, though, police are on scene because they were investigating this deadly accident. A woman in her pickup hit a guardrail, then a pole here along 249, flipped her truck, police say, and was ejected. She was the only person in that pickup. She died on scene. No other car was involved. Still, a lot of questions, though, about exactly what happened when the HPD officer was blocking this traffic. We want to know too, was he standing in or outside of his SUV? Was he in the SUV? Again, they're still very busy out here. As soon as we get any more information, we will let you know. For now, reporting live, Courtney Fisher, ABC 13 Eyewitness News.